When it comes to keeping the cold air out during the winter time, a lot of us are led to believe the problem rests solely with our old windows. Well, maybe the case, but when it comes to going green on the cheap, there are plenty of other places to start other than your windows. You see, it's cracks like these, intrusions like this that most of us, we don't really think about, but this is where a lot of the problems happen. So I got some of this uh, spray foam. This is the non-expanding type, which is really important. And I'm just gonna go around the house and, uh, ooh, yummy spray foam. Again, it's not one of the most beautiful things to look at, but hopefully it'll get us through the winter and we'll save some money doing it. Weather stripping. I, I know it's not sexy to talk about weather stripping, but you'd be amazed how much air moves through here, especially after my cat has done a rotisserie action on my doggone weather stripping. So I'm gonna take this out. <laughs> Comes out really a little too easily. And uh, you can just see how bad that is. To replace this, well, right around $5. Now moving inside, going green and the cheap, obviously the first thing we have to talk about are these compact fluorescent lights. I know not everybody likes these things, but in this chandelier, I uh, actually replaced this all with uh, CFLs and I can see a difference on my utility bill almost immediately. Outlet plugs, if they're on an exterior wall, here's another area where you might be able to save yourself a few dollars. Go ahead and take the plate cover off and what happens a lot of the time is air that does manage to get into your exterior wall, well, this is just a, a, a freeway, a, a very readily conduit for that cold air to intrude into your living spaces. So we're gonna try to, well, we can't stop it completely. We're gonna try to slow it down with this. Dun, da, da, da. Not exactly what you call these. They're just little insulating, a little bit of foam. It fits right over the outlet like that. You put the cover back on and bingo. Now these costs, I think last time I checked these were what about 18 cents a piece, maybe, not less. I know it's a little thing, but when it comes to saving yourself money on your utility bill, going green on the cheap, the little things that all add up. Turn lights off when you leave a room. When you leave the house, make sure the thermostat is dialed as far down as possible. To take it to the next level, you'd want an energy audit done of your home. Utilities can perform this, places like Earth Advantage Institute can do it, where they basically come into your home, set up a blower door test, find out how much air leakage your home really has. It's the next level, but it's a great way to save money in the long run off your utility bills.